I think what you just said there, like a positive view on death, I think that's something that if you can, a lot of people have trouble seeing that, but if you can see it, if if you can see that positivity within death, um, and and I think a big part of that for for me has just been sort of approaching death from like what, what for me feels like a logical perspective, but of the idea that incorporates the concept of be it soul or be it whatever, but the idea that like, yes, beyond death, like the whole, it's the whole like we're a spiritual being in a human body. So therefore, what yeah. is our relationship to the body? And one of the best metaphors that I've heard for death is this idea that it's like taking off a tight boot. And to me, that just made so much sense because you know that feeling where it's just it's a release, and and it's, it's very interesting because if people want to call in and talk about this, like I'm open to it, but experiences with DMT and everything like that. From my own personal experience, like and, and and other things, it's this idea that like an, a DMT experience is like experiencing death without dying, and having seen mm-hmm. that experience, it's it's it is it is this like you're going through a portal, you're going through a wormhole, and you're actually entering in to like another realm. And as sci-fi yeah. as that sounds, that's like you know me trying to use my words to explain the ineffable. And it's so much more for that, too. But that's just a couple thoughts. If anybody wants to, uh-huh. go ahead. We have, actually, I will say, yeah. sorry, I was just going to say, we do have another caller uh, that we can bring on. So just a couple points, and then we'll bring that next caller on. So we'll go, go ahead, though. Yeah, so I, I think that the thing to also remember is that we, we do have all these really profound psychological and metaphysical ways of engaging and looking at death. But I think, too, we have to address that there are fears surrounding death. And it's okay to have those fears. And I think sometimes we do the bypassing because it is it is a beautiful experience of release and surrender. But at the same time, the body is going to go through these very profound changes. And having sat with family members that I've had to see go through that process, it's it's a struggle. But it is a powerful transformation. It's like when the butterfly comes out of the the cocoon. And I think we have to acknowledge that the body itself is decaying. And I think we do a lot of uh, talking around it, but the truth is everything dies. You know, relationship and, you know, uh, the show will eventually end, but we will cease to exist in our current form. And I think when we start to sit with that as an idea and we start to look at what our reactions are to that idea, we can do the deeper work of coming to an understanding of what death actually is. And when we can embrace that, it becomes a beautiful thing and not something that terrifies us. I have a friend who was... Uh